So today guys I bring you one of the fastest methods in earning credits in Starfield that works on both Xbox and PC without cheats. How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so you may have seen the glitch where you have to jump out of the map on New Atlantis and make your way around to grab a chest. This for many, many people was a pain in the backside. Uh, but at the end of it, you grab those 30, well, 72,000 credits out of that chest. But today, guys, with this method, it gets much, much quicker and easier. And it requires you, all it requires you to have is a knife, a sword, or an axe. Basically, anything you can block with. So this is how the glitch works and I have no doubt this will be a glitch used to reap benefits in other places within the game. So with a melee weapon within your hand, go into that third person, then run, jump and press that block button and forward at the same time. When you land you will notice that your character will sometimes glitch and teleport forward. And this is what we use and what we're going to use to glitch through the wall and grab that chest on New Atlantis which has that 72,000 credits within it which you can farm over and over again. Now it is a little bit tricky to get down but once you do get it down you are golden. I won't lie it took me about 15 minutes to figure out the best way to do this which works best and it worked best for me without a shadow of a doubt. So I saw other methods which were nowhere near as well as efficient as this one. Okay so you want to head to Alpha Century then to Jameson and then to New Atlantis. Once you have loaded in near the ships, you will see that ship services technician. This guy holds 72,000 credits. And if you didn't know, all vendors within this game have a chest where those credits are stored. Buying and selling to said vendors means if you glitch to their chest, you can also recover said loot for free. Same with this dude and your ships, so it may be worth a thought from you. But yes, from here guys, you want to follow this short path I make down this ramp. Remember, you need a melee weapon, an axe, a knife, a sword, anything that you can block with. Now, as I was shown via TikTok, uh, a video, a guy trying this, which just did not work for me. He was getting it down, he looked perfect for him, but for me, I couldn't get it to work. So you need to come to this point, there's, there's three doors, the very left door you want to go to and just left of this left door you can see this small piece of wall right here. This is the wall that we're going to glitch through using that jump block teleport glitch. Now to get this perfect go into third person and run and jump and press that block button and forward and land right here facing this section of the wall so you want to land right here guys i've paused this on screen you want to land on this little piece which separates the two paths the black and the gray you want to land on this piece this is the piece you want to aim for while pressing that forward and block button and you want to be facing this small section of the wall the gap in between the door and this other section now how I was doing this and what worked best for me was I backed up to a point where I could sprint and then jump and try and land on this point while holding that block and forward and this was working way best for me taking me less than 5 attempts each time. So as you can see me doing on screen now back up to these smaller lamps sprint then just jump and then press block as late as possible by the way and forward at the same time so you want to sprint jump you want to try and land on that small section and just as you're about to land press that block button obviously you're going to be holding forward anyway because of momentum or the way in which your direction is going so you want to be pressing block and forward at the same time trying to land on that small piece and if you land on that section which separates the black and the gray aiming at a small piece on that wall you should pop straight through the wall now once you do get this down guys and get this to work for you once you are through the wall guys just simply head right towards this chest jump up a little then loot it for its contents from here you want to reset this chest and the fastest way to do this is to head to venus so here guys head to that soul system as you can see on the screen now then guys just head to venus and land your ship Get up and then go to your bed and sleep for 6 hours. This resets that vendor back on New Atlantis. From here guys head back to Alpha Century then Jameson and then to New Atlantis. From here you first need to talk to the vendor to reset his chest. A lot of people are probably trying to do this without speaking to the vendor in between and seeing that the chest is empty. You need to speak to the vendor first. 
So upon doing this and speaking to that vendor, use this glitch again, jump through the wall and grab those credits and rinse and repeat until you are super super rich. It is as simple as that guys. Remember, jump through the wall, grab those credits out of that chest, head to Venus, sleep for 6 hours, head back here, speak to the vendor, rinse and repeat. And there we have it guys. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully guys, I will see you on that next one.